Knots ruling out a return to New York, a top aide for Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez, floating the idea the congresswoman would actually support Amazon's return to New York if the process was done right and there was community input. That's kind of interesting. Comes as top business officials in Virginia are ready to welcome Amazon's second headquarters in their neck of the woods. And we're joined by Jason Miller now, CEO of the Greater Washington Partnership, organization of local CEOs. Um, Jason, thank you for coming on. We appreciate it. We've covered this story from just about every angle. And we had a local elected official from your area on recently who was basically making the argument and looking at the numbers because your economy is very strong. An unemployment rate, I think, in that general area is like under 2%. Says, well, we just don't need Amazon. We don't need the jobs. Mm -hmm. right. So take it from well, there. What sure. do you say? Uh, look, thank you for having me on. Uh, if you look at this region, the capital region, Baltimore, Washington, and Richmond, it's the third largest regional economy in the United States. It has an incredible workforce. It's actually the third largest tech workforce in the U.S. But if you look at the, econo uh, the economy's performance to, since 2012, we've been slow growth, 1.2% growth. That's less than the U.S. economy overall. That's slower than other major metropolitan areas, and that has a real impact. Why is you that? Look Too at, much government uh, work, or what, what's the reason for that? Well, yeah, I mean, some of it is an over-reliance on the federal yeah. government as the major employer. Some of it is, if you just look at the startup ecosystem here, despite the talent, despite the diversity in the workforce, despite our strong assets, we're not performing yet up to our potential. And that's mm -hmm. why, in part, this is so important. This is about more than the 25,000 Amazon jobs. This is about reshaping the trajectory of the economy going forward. So how's it it's going on the messaging front? I mentioned uh, uh, Congresswoman sure. Cortez, you know, what she says here in New York, and it, it, she's kind of flipping, uh, it sounds like, a little bit of what she said earlier, but her point now is like, hey, listen, if the community, if there's community input, I'm, and they're for it, I'm for it, is basically what she's saying. What, what about the relationship between the community and people like you making the case for Amazon? How has it yeah. gone down there? Yeah, I mean, throughout the process, even before the announcement, there's been broad support here. Some of that support yeah. is due to the recognition that our economy needs the jolt in the arm, that it's about more than the 25,000 jobs, that's about diversifying the economy. And if you look at the process itself, when there was 20 finalists, mm -hmm. three of them were in this region, Maryland, yeah. Virginia, and the district. And it's, it's important, the two governors and the mayor came together. They wrote a letter to Amazon that said, irrespective of which of the three of us you choose, you have three partners in you if you come here. That's mm -hmm. important because they recognize the benefits of the region, but that's also important in the region coming together to tackle issues like transportation, like talent, issues that existed irrespective of whether Amazon was growing here. And I think this gives us the catalyst to, to make even more progress. Last thing real quick, we have maybe 20 seconds. March 16th, from what I understand, there's a this big county board meeting. Any worry about that, that there'll be fireworks? It's kind of what happened in the city council here in New York. And these sure, opponents look, come in and... I think the support here has been consistent. I think the support here has been broad-based. And a lot of the investments that are being made, and I think this is something that's misunderstood, the investments that are being made mm -hmm. are in the talent and workforce system. They're in transportation projects that the community has long wanted. Right. So this is a big potential benefit to the economy, and it's about more than just the direct jobs. All right, Jason, thanks for coming on. We're going to continue to follow it. Uh, Thank down you. In Northern Virginia, appreciate it. Thank you for having okay. me.